the Missouri National Guard one-on-one. -on -one. Missouri National Guard, always ready, always there. Well, Justin Britt, one of the anchors of the Mizzou offensive line that uh, has gotten the Tigers all the way to the SEC championship game this Saturday against Auburn. Uh, Justin, coming off the win uh, over Texas A&M, obviously the offense played a, a lot better in the second half than in the first half. What do you feel like uh, the, the difference was in the second half against the Aggies? Um, you know, we just went into halftime and focused on execution. Uh, the game plan stayed the same. You know, Coach Henson and all the rest of the staff, you know, they come up with great game plans every week. And uh, they did another great job. It was all about execution and what we had to do. So we just focused on finishing more than we did the first half. You know, after every rep, after every play, um, just finishing a little bit longer through the whistle. Um, and, you know, I think it showed through the run game and definitely through the pass protection. Tell me about how that run game opens things up uh, for the big plays through the air because you could tell in the second half you guys established that ground attack and then it, it really opened up some big plays, uh, particularly to LaDamian Washington and Doriel Green Beckham. Um, I think through the first half, you know, we they weren't doing well running. And so they, they knew that we had to try to throw and get a good play and open up the box. Um, so they, they had it stacked and that's something that we knew coming into the second half that they would have it, uh, the, the box stacked up. And so we had to establish a run game. It was either we do it or we don't. And, uh, you know, the offensive line just took that mentality that we're going to do it. And by doing that, um, they bring even more people in the box to try to stop the run. And, you know, James is a great player, and we have great receivers. They're tall, fast, and we know they can make plays. So all we got to do is protect long enough for them to make plays. And, uh, you know, that last drive, you know, run, run, run play action, roll back, pass it to Eric Waters. I mean, if that's not a great example of how to set up a pass, I don't know what it is. You know, uh, SEC East champions with that win, uh, with all the success, an 11-1 record come uh, honors for a lot of uh, you and a lot of your teammates. Max Copeland, one of your line mates, is a finalist for the Burlesworth Trophy. Uh, what does Max bring to this offensive line and to this team? Um, you know, Max is a bright kid, you know, getting a physics major. Um, you know, he's one of the leaders, you know, along with me on the offensive line. But, uh, you know, he brings that enthusiastic attitude, always having fun, always ready to work. Uh, you know, he never takes a day off, you know, not a playoff. Um, you know, he's someone that you can trust day in and day out. As you guys uh, look at Auburn and uh, the, the strong defense that they have over there, what are some of the keys you think uh, for the offense to have a chance to win the, the first conference championship in the, in the new league? Uh, we just got to do our film study, everything that we've done to this point to get us to where we are, um, you know, prepare the way we have. Um, but we, we got to make sure that our run game works. You know, they have a great defensive line, probably the best that we'll face this year. Um, so we understand the challenge, not that any week hasn't been challenging, but uh, that'll definitely open up the passing game like we've talked about. But um, you know, just to get a balanced attack and have it work. And what is the best way to block out all the exterior stuff? Because it's going to be a supercharged atmosphere all week. There are going to be a lot of distractions, as I'm sure you know, and your coaches have talked to you about. How do you push all that to the side and do what this team has done so well all year, and that's focus on yourselves? Um, just try to avoid watching ESPN, anything that talks about sports. Um, you know, I don't think a lot of people read the newspapers anymore, so I don't think that's a problem. Uh, you know, maybe this week stay off social media more than you have uh, and make sure you get in the film room and watch extra film. And I know that uh, school is coming to a close, so maybe you can put all your extra time into that. Um, just something to get your mind off things and to focus on what really matters. Well, and what really matters is that SEC championship. Uh, appreciate your time, Justin, and uh, good luck on Saturday. Thank you. That's Justin Britt. He and the Tigers take on Auburn Saturday, 3 p.m., the Southeastern Conference Championship in Atlanta.